Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you all for joining me again. I'm going to show you guys a quick tutorial on how to earn AVAX uh, using the AVAX wallet. Uh, make sure you get the right URLs. The URLs down below in the description. Make sure you don't uh, go to some scam site or anything. Uh, but this one is a very simple process, very simple tutorial. So let's get started. <laughs> Is, whether it's on Coinbase Pro or you know wherever you have it, um, you're going to go ahead and withdraw it. Uh, my AVAX wallet is currently on a ledger, which I connect via through MetaMask. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that ID in there. Uh, there are, sorry, the address. And you're going to need, this is very important, you're going to need at least 25 AVAX to uh, delegate in order to earn on the AVAX wallet's uh, earn function. Um, now, make sure you add a little extra to cover the fees as well. The fees are not substantial. It's like 0 0.002 or something like that. Uh, but you're just gonna need to make sure you copy enough over. Uh, once you have done that, you can go ahead and withdraw it. I've already withdrawn the 25, so let's go ahead and head over to our AVAX wallet. So you can see here, I have the 25 AVAX. I've already moved this over, but basically when you copy it over, it's gonna be on the C chain. Um, so what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to click here on cross chain and we're gonna have to uh, select the source chain as C chain, which is the contract chain. And we're gonna have to move it to the platform chain, which is the P chain. And you would enter the amount of 25 AVAX. Um, you can see here if I do 25 AVAX, so the overall fees are gonna be 0 0.0003 for the export fee and the import fee is gonna be 0 0.001. So very, very insignificant. Uh, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and once that's done and it's on your P chain, you're gonna head over to earn. And once you're in the earn section, uh, you're gonna see here, you have validate, delegate. Uh, so with 25 AVAX, you can add a delegator. Uh, if you have 2000 AVAX at least on your P chain, you can actually add a validator. Uh, but we're not high rollers like that yet. So we're gonna go ahead and click add delegator. So once you're in Add Delegator, here you can see all the different nodes that you can, uh, you know, become a delegator on. Um, here is a very simple section. You can see here the node ID, the validator stake, what's available, um, how many delegators are in there, the end time, and the fee. And it's a very, I guess, simple, uh, you know, dialogue that they show you here. But it makes things simple for you as well because it puts things basically in layman terms. Um, so what you would do is you would just select one, like so like let's say, I don't know, let's do a 15 day one. Uh, it's a very low fee. Uh, here you could get all the info, uh, your staking end date, your stake amount, your, the reward address, the staking duration, the estimated reward, all that kind of stuff. Um, and like let's say we were gonna say 25, so your estimated reward would be 0.12 AVAX with a 0.01 fee. So essentially you'd be walking with 0.11 AVAX. And then all you would do is you would click confirm. Like I said, it's a very, very simple process. Uh, I hope you guys found this useful. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe so I can make more videos like these. Hope you all have a wonderful day.